Hello, sir. Hello, Jason. Put a little date on food that will go bad to let people know when to eat it by it so they don't get food poisoning. Okay, sir. Oh, oh, that sounds important. So I'll put it in a large font right on the front of the packet, maybe in a high visibility colour so no one can miss it. <laughs> no, Jason. Put it in tiny writing in a spot no one will ever look. <laughs> <sighs> no, but sir, this is for people's safety. Shut up, Jason. Call it a use by date. Okay, sure. Well, um, let's start with uh, milk. Milk will last about two weeks, Jason, so print a little date two weeks in the future from when it was made on the bottle. Okay, sir, and I'll put a two week use by date on cream too, because that's made from milk. <laughs> no, Jason, cream will last a month. Oh, but it's made from milk. Shut up, Jason! Sour cream. What's that, sir? It's cream that's sour, Jason. Oh, and is it sour because it's gone past its use by date, so that means you have to throw it away? No, Jason, what are you stupid? Sour cream is something completely different, but also made from milk that will last a month. <laughs> okay, uh, what about butter, sir? Three weeks? That's also made. Put a little salt in it, it'll last about four weeks. Yogurt? Six weeks. Cheese? Hard or soft cheese, Jason? Soft? Couple of weeks. Hard? Could be months, Jason. <laughs> Grow some mould on it, who cares? <laughs> but all of that is made from milk. Yeah. And milk lasts? Probably only a couple of weeks, yeah. But the use by date is rock solid, sir. Don't eat it past this date. No, Jason, most of them will be totally fine to eat a little bit after the use by date. And if you're worried about it, maybe just give it the sniff test, because that's kind of a good barometer on how fresh something is. And if you don't know, just let your grandma do the sniff test. And no matter how far past the use by date, she'll probably say, yes, fine, just eat it. OK, uh, well, what about lettuce? People will get the lettuce and put it in a bag themselves, Jason. No, but, but, but what about the use by date? No use by date, Jason. People have got it themselves so they can figure it out themselves. Okay then, so I won't put a use by date on lettuce and other salad leaves that have been put in a bag already. <laughs> no, Jason, put a use by date on that. What are you, stupid? What, but you- Shut up, Jason. Okay, sir, what about fresh fish? Jason, you have to take that home and basically cook it immediately. Right, okay, so after you cook it- you eat it, Jason. You could put it in the fridge for maybe a day, but you've got to eat it, Jason, or go off. Okay, and what about fish in a can? An eternity. What? H how does that even- Shut up, Jason! What about canned fruit, sir? Put a date on it. A use by date? <laughs> no, Jason! A best before date. <laughs> What's that? It's best before the date, Jason. What are you, stupid? Right, but it's still okay after the date? Yeah! So what's the point of that? So won't people get confused by the best before date and the use by date? Like, what's the point of the best before date if it's still okay after? Won't people just get see that date and think it's a use by date and then throw the food out when it's actually fine to eat? Yep. Oh, but the waste, sir. Jason, Jason, Jason. Put a best before date on things like chocolate, cereal, biscuits, sugar, flour, sauces, jams, the kind of stuff that won't ever spoil. What even is a best before date? Well, maybe, Jason, after the date, things will just not be the best. But they won't spoil? No. So they're not the best quality after the date? Supposedly not. Because still eat them. Okay, so shops can't sell them after the date then. Okay, got it, sorted. <laughs> no, Jason, shops can still sell it after the best before date. What are you, stupid? What? No, oh, this is so confusing, sir. What about eggs? By date on them, Jason, even though you could just chuck them in water and see if they float or sink. <laughs> It's a perfectly good way to tell if they're all right. <laughs> Sir, soft drink. Surely that lasts forever. Put an expiry date on it, Jason. What does that even mean? Glue. Glue. Put a date on it, Jason. No, sir. Pillows. What the? Salt. Sir, salt's a preservative. It doesn't need it. <laughs> Shut up, Jason. Bottled water. You're telling me water goes off? No, Jason, the water doesn't go off. Why put an expiry on it then? It's the bottle, Jason. It starts leaking into the water. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Beer. You said anything in a can will last for an eternity. You still gonna put a use by date on it? Yeah. <laughs> Anything else? Yes, Jason. The people who manufacture the products are responsible for putting the date on the products. What? No, what? No, so they can just put anything. Gotta go, Jason. No, 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 sir. Shut up, Jason, or I'll put an expiry date on you. Can I have an expiry date on my job? <laughs> no, Jason. Damn. My paid. My script is a little moist. <laughs>